British Prime Minister Kirsten Ma says people smuggling should be put on a par with global terrorism as he pushed for closer international cooperation to tackle the issue. The Labour Party leader, a former chief state prosecutor in England and Wales, has vowed to smash the gangs behind the trade, amidst concern at the rising number of undocumented migrants crossing the channel from France. UK government statistics show that nearly 32,000 undocumented migrants have been brought ashore in 2024 after attempting the crossing. At least 60 people have died, the worst year since records began in 2018. Addressing international police chiefs in Glasgow, Stammer said that his government would double the 75 million euros it has earmarked to tackle criminal people smuggling gangs. I'm pleased to say today that the UK is increasing its funding for Interpol projects, investing £6 million this financial year. This includes support for improved data sharing and faster communications capabilities. The first ever global fraud threat assessment and new regional networks. From strengthening cooperation across the Pacific to tackling drug and gun smuggling networks in the Caribbean. Make no mistake, people smuggling needs a global response. And on a scale way beyond where we are now. We need to unlock the power of that cooperation across borders, agencies, continents even. Later this week, Samar is due to attend a summit of the European political community in Hungary, where migration and people smuggling are expected to feature eye on the agenda.